Hello Explorers, welcome back to another exciting video and thanks for watching. In this video we shall be taking a look at some strange and mysterious but very interesting tourist attractions in Africa. Africa is a large continent with interesting people, fascinating cultures with historical destinations, landmarks and communities whose names and stories evoke a sense of wonder. It should come as no surprise that Africa is home to some of the most mysterious geological formations and man-made places on earth. Much of what happens on the African continent can be explained, but to this day, some destinations remain shrouded in mystery with the world's greatest minds unable to determine their history or even explain their remarkable features. Some of these destinations will leave you scratching your head, others will leave you with goosebumps, but they all promise mystery and intrigue by the bucket load, even if you're the most cynical of travelers. To be on the safe side though, maybe take a friend. If you're new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our daily uploads. So if you are the adventurous type and visiting strange places is in your bucket list, then come along with us as we take you to the 10 mysterious places to visit in Africa. Number 1. The Giant Blue Eye of Africa in Mauritania One of the strange wonders of Africa is the Giant Blue Eye of Africa, also known as the Richard Structure, found in the Western Sahara Desert in Mauritania. The spectacular structure is a blue circle, like the eye, in the sands of Mauritania and is believed to be around 100 million years old. This bull's eye in the Sahara has sparked several scientific inquiries and none has been able to unravel the mystery surrounding this spot. Some people describe it as a hole that was formed when God flooded the earth with water in the days of Noah, as recorded in the Holy Bible. While its origin may never be known despite the deluge of scientific inquiries, images of this strange feature as taken from space by astronauts continue to intrigue and inspire the world. Number 2. Lake Nature and Tanzania Africa houses some of the largest freshwater lakes in the world but Lake Nature in Tanzania is the purple cow in the park. This red blood deadly lake which borders Tanzania and Kenya seems like a scene from a horror movie. This lake is dangerous to life due to its soda and salt content and it also houses deposits of sodium carbonate. The water also has the ability to calcify animals into stone. This is not due to any mysterious spell. It is simply because of the salt and high alkaline pH in the water. The water's pH has been measured as high as 10.5, nearly as high as ammonia. It was used by ancient Egyptians to mummify their dead. Number 3. Crook's Corner, Limpopo, South Africa Crook's Corner is located in the far northeastern corner of the Kruger National Park. Here the Luvuvu and Limpopo rivers come together where Zimbabwe, Mozambique and South Africa meet. Today, it's a world of fat baobabs, yellowback fever trees and rivers bursting with hippos and crocodiles as big as dinosaurs. It makes a shady drive along the river from the Pafuri picnic site north of Pundamaria Kam. This place was a no man's land a century or so ago. This historical island destination derived its name from the outlaws who lived there in the 90s. It has become a very prominent tourist attraction in South Africa. Number 4. Blue River, Abia State, Nigeria It's weird to call any mass water blue since we are taught by science that water is nearly, if not totally colorless. But the Azumini River, which radiates a breathtaking charm in the Umwahia Ubeku in Abia State, Nigeria, makes you want to think twice about this theory. The Ubeku Blue River is so named on account of its stunning sapphire and crystal clear waters that makes it easy to spot fishes and other aquatic animals. As you sail further down the river, the blue color of the water strikes your eyes. It's claimed that no river is as clear and blue as the stunning brook. Its aesthetics are irresistible, coupled with its large greenery and the Azumini hill that surrounds the clear water. Legend has it that this hill was the major reason why the Azumini founders decided to settle in the present location after they fled their ancestral home in today's Ijo. Number 5. The Abandoned Outdoor Movie Theatre in Egypt on the northern cape of the Sina Desert in Egypt lies a cluster of seats for an outdoor movie cinema. According to Estonian photographer Kalpo Kikas, who recently visited the abandoned location, the theatre was built some decades ago by an unnamed Frenchman. One day while at the Sina Desert with his legion of friends, they decided to build a movie theatre there. They headed to Cairo and brought in hundreds of old seats, a generator and a giant screen for the project. 
But the locals who seemed not to be impressed by the idea sabotaged the opening of the theater. Until date, that theater remains forgotten in the middle of the Sina Desert. An Italian pop band named Stadio are some of the artists who have used the theater to shoot a music video. Number 6. Lake Nios, Cameroon Guinness Book of Records has dubbed Lake Nios as the deadliest lake in the world. Why? Well, one night in 1986, the lake killed about 1,700 people and nearly 3,500 livestock. The incident also left many others with health problems because of the chemicals the lake emanated. Nios is a crater lake in the northwest region of Cameroon. The lake is on the side of an inactive volcano and is impounded by a volcanic dam. There's a pocket of magma underneath the lake which leaks carbon dioxide into the water. The water then changes this into carbonic acid and makes the lake one of three exploding lakes in the world. Number 7. The Seven Colored Earth of Chamorro, Mauritius For ages, the story of this volcanic phenomenon remains shrouded in mystery. Located on the southwestern cape of Mauritius, this world-famous destination is bordered by an 83-meter-high waterfall, which gives stories a panoramic view of this beautiful attraction. It was formed by a volcanic eruption. As the name suggests, it is a small area of sand dunes with seven distinct colors. Thousands of tourists visit this area on a yearly basis to behold the strange sight. Number 8. Avenue of Baobabs in Madagascar the Avenue of Baobabs is a prominent group of grandiose Baobabs lining the dirt road between Morondava and Beloni City Bihina in the Menabe region of western Madagascar. Its striking landscape draws travelers from around the world making it one of the most visited locations in the region. It has been a center of local conservation efforts and was granted temporary protected status in July 2007 by the Ministry of Environment, Water and Forest, a step towards making it Madagascar's first natural monument. Number 9. Skeletons Coast, Namibia The Skeletons Coast is littered with more than a thousand shipwrecks. Many of the vessels lost their way in the thick fog, ran aground and were destroyed in the heavy surf. Interestingly, the wrecks are not the source of the name Skeleton's Coast. This moniquet came from the region's history of whaling and sealing. The industries which lasted into the early 1900s left bleached white skeletons stretched along the entire coastline. Massive whale skeletons are still encountered on the beach today, but the rusting old ship have come to symbolize the region. The majority of the Skeleton's Coast is unpopulated and inaccessible. Travelers visit the area by driving over the beaches and dunes in four-wheel drive cars or flight seeing in light aircrafts. While ground travel is the best option for experiencing the desert and its wildlife in person, flight seeing is an exciting way to see the immensity of the coastline. Number 10. White Desert in Egypt Just a few hours from the busting metropolis of Cairo lies a desert that will make you feel like you've just landed on the surface of the moon. Formed by centuries of erosion and sandstorms, these unique calcium rock formations crop up across the landscape like great abstract statues. Some that resemble food have been given names like mushroom and ice cream cone, while others have inspired more grandiose designations such as the monolith and inselberg. Arguably the most characteristic of these peculiar natural formations is the famed chicken and tree set, also called the chicken and mushroom, or better still, chicken and atomic bomb. Only in the white desert will you encounter such a bizarre and away inspiring natural museum of chalk rock. There you have it, Desplorers. If you love adventures, those are some mysterious destinations in Africa you absolutely should visit. Thanks for watching this video. If you did enjoy the video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and share with your friends.